Hello guys, it's uh, fairly early, the sun just come up about a half hour ago again, and we're back at the same place from yesterday, and uh, I think the good news is all the, the hard work of cutting the trees and, and uh, all that stuff's done, and so now the challenge today is to figure out how to pick them up and uh, maybe put them in the dump trail, pull them with a tractor, just grab them with the excavator, um, whatever we end up doing to haul them, like, uh, it's more, probably more like 300 plus yards where the, my buddy wants to, uh, pile them. And I talked to him, I said, we should just make some tree piles out there in the field and burn them. Um, but he doesn't want to do that because he doesn't want to interfere with, uh, the farmer, um, farming him. By the way, if you're my wife, uh, this is not chew in my lip. I don't know what it is, but it's not chew. Um, so anyway, we're going to get our dump trailer hooked up, and uh, I like it because it's kind of challenging because I don't normally haul around uh, a bunch of tree brush for a living, so it's neat to me to see if we can do it and how we're going to do it and if it's going to work out, and I'll try to get some uh, video footage of it today. Thanks for watching.
This is my buddy uh, Jesse that owns the place. Are you gonna try and take it that way? I dare ya. Go ahead and try it. Oh shit. Yeah, that's not a good idea. I was poor filming on my part, but the uh, rear driver's side wheel of his tractor just come off the ground because it's a downhill slope here that we're dealing with. It's not horrible, but it's enough. So he's going to hook up to this thing and pull it. Let's peek at his tractor here while he's doing that. He's got a uh, Kubota. L4701 it looks like with an LA765 loader on there nice tires on there and he's just running some chains that he's got hooked up there and hooking around the stump of the tree and pulling her up there He's all business. He, he is. He's got a hell of a work ethic. Let's watch him drag this sucker out of there. Here's Jessie, going to uh, give her a heck and try to push these trees. Oh, give her, give her hell, Jessie. 
Jesse. Pardon my language. He's trying, <laughs> He's trying to push these trees into that creek there. We're piling them up, and eventually he'll, he'll end up burning them. Look at him throwing mud. There was a good one. Just giving it everything he's got. That's awesome. These are the good times. We just sometimes we don't realize them when we're in it, but these are definitely the good times. About an hour ago, he comes out and meets me with a beer. He took a five-minute break and went back to work. Oh, where's he going now? He's going over to push over here. Yeah, you're doing good. He's, he, he might be showing off or he's getting a little rammy. I'm not sure, but he's doing good. <laughs> if I ever got rid of my uh, excavator, I'd want one a little bigger tractor like that for an acreage tractor. I got my little Kubota, which I love. But that one, that one there has got a little more snort. I can't have both right now. I mean, that'd be too much money. But if I ever didn't have an excavator, I'd get one of them. Oh, here's, here's the young Mr. Beam. He's dragging the tree in. The whole family's going to work today. 